Well, good morning, everyone. Pastor Corey Rowland here with Yorkville First Pleasant Grove and Tippecanoe United Methodist Church. And I have a devotional to share with you today out of the book of Genesis. And it's Genesis 9, verse 13. And God says, I have set my bow in the clouds, and it shall be a sign of the covenant between me and the earth. And so this is talking about why God created the rainbow. And regardless of what the world says or what the world uses the rainbow as, a rain, the rainbow, and every time we see it in the sky, should be a reminder of the covenant that God made with us, specifically with Noah. The rainbow serves as a sign of the covenant that God would never again flood the earth. Remember, mankind was so bad that God had to flood the entire earth, and he completely destroyed every living creature except the animals that Noah brought on the ark and Noah and his seven family members. And God, after after he had punished and after Noah got out of the ark, God said, I'll never ever do that again. And so he put the rainbow in the sky as a sign of his covenant. And so I want you to uh, use this verse today and this idea of the rainbow as a reminder of the faithfulness of God. When God says something, he will not go back on it. I mean, that was... He said this at the time of Noah's flood all those thousands of years ago, and he still has not flooded the earth again, even though we've asked for it many times with our sin, because God is a faithful God. And so we can rely on his promises. And God always uses a sign. When he makes a covenant, he always uses a sign to say, look, this sign marks the covenant I'm making with you. He used circumcision for Abraham. He used the rainbow for Noah. Today, he uses the covenant of baptism for the believers who accept him. And it is a trustworthy sign. God does not go back on his word. And so maybe there are times in your life, personal things that God has done to show you his faithfulness. Use those times in your life as a reminder of God's faithfulness. And remember those times, then when you get into the difficult times and when troubles come your way, you can look back at the sign that God has given you. Just as Noah could look back at the rainbow after a big rainstorm and he could say, no, the Lord will not flood the earth again. God is a faithful God and he is faithful to you and I. And doesn't that sound like a God we should be worshiping every day? Amen.